Hey guys, Tech Mature with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to delete apps on your iPhone permanently. Now, there's a few ways to delete an app on your iPhone, and you want to follow these steps to permanently delete an app on your iPhone. So, let's go ahead and pick an app that you like to permanently delete on your iPhone. So, I'm going to go ahead and pick maybe here Pandora, right? Or you can pick any app. Now, the key thing to do here is you locate the app and you do a long press and hold. And once you do that, the menu will pop up where you can remove apps. So if you click on remove app, you can see the option to delete app. Now, if you remove from home screen, your iPhone still will have the app in the app library. So you need to select a delete app and then finally confirm that and it will be removed from your phone completely or permanently. Now, another way to also do that is through by going into your setting of your iPhone. Now, once you get into your setting of your iPhone, you're going to go to general and then look for iPhone storage here. And you can browse all the apps here that you have available that are using your iPhone storage here. So you can show more here. And let's go ahead and pick another one. This time, maybe we want to delete Amazon Music right here. As you can see here, we can also delete it here permanently from this list over here. If we delete it here, it'll also be removed or deleted from our home page as well and then the other place you can check if you have an app is under app library so the ones that we deleted like pandora right as you can see here, it's no longer there even for amazon music it's no longer there as well in our list and we have permanently deleted those two apps now of course when you do permanently delete an app you can always re-download it in the future by going into the app store and then searching up the app itself of course and then you can download it from there as well like for this case right you search it up and this also tells us that if you have this arrow icon or the get icon that means it's not installed on your iPhone so you can reinstall it again but from our phone we have deleted the app completely or permanently for now and I hope this video was helpful if so please make sure to like and subscribe button more for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices see you guys next time